everyone, Noob Swing Trader here, and today I want to make a really short video uh, teaching you guys how to download TD Ameritrade's Thinkorswim platform. Uh, this is a platform that I use personally uh, to look at stocks and do my research uh, before I take a position on any stock. So I want to make a really quick video showing you guys uh, how to download it. I did mention in one of my previous videos it is a little tricky. Um, I did have some issues and I had to call customer service uh, to, to try and figure out what was what was wrong. Um, but hopefully if you guys follow these instructions you guys won't have any problems and you'll be able to download it uh, without any issues. So let's get right into it. I'm going to start sharing my uh, Google Chrome here. So first thing you want to do, go to go to google.com, search for TD Ameritrade, and then you'll see one of the top links here. It's going to it's going to be tdameritrade.com forward slash home dot page. So you'll click on that, and then right up here on the top right corner, you're going to see open new account. Okay, you're going to click on that. And then you're going to have to fill this form out. Okay, you're going to have to put all your information in. You do have to put your social security number. Uh, and you, I believe you do have to link your bank account. But you do not need to make a deposit. Okay, so keep that in mind. You do not need to make a deposit. Okay, so once you guys have gone through this form and you've filled everything out, you're gonna go. Uh, you're gonna go back, and you're gonna log in. Okay, so you're gonna go back to the home page. Okay, this is just from clicking on that, clicking on that second link, right? The tdameritrade.com forward slash home dot page, and then you're gonna log in with your username and password that you just created. Okay, and I'm gonna flip over to this tab just because I've already logged in. Um, but you're going to see, I just wanted to show you guys, this is my account value. I, do, I did not make a deposit. I still have not made a deposit. I don't use uh, TD Ameritrade to trade stocks. I use Robinhood because there's no commission fees. Um, so I just wanted to show you guys that it is possible to get this software without having to make a deposit. Okay, so once you've logged in, uh, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go over to this client services tab up here and then you're going to click on under my profile you're going to click on general okay and then in here under the exchange agreements section uh, there should be four things that you need to do so the first thing is where it says your status you're going to need to, you, there's a, there's going to be a link here and you're going to need to click that you are a non-professional. Okay. I'm assuming if you're doing this, you're, you're a beginner and you are not a professional. So, uh, you need to make sure that this says non-professional. Um, otherwise I think there's, there's some fees that you got to pay or, or, you know, but, but make sure it says non-professional here. And then these, uh, agreements, uh, you're going to have to sign. Okay, so when it's all said and done, these three need to say signed right here. And this one needs to say non-professional. Okay, this is a, a pretty important step. Uh, and Okay, and now that you've now that you've gone in here and you've signed these agreements and you've made sure this says non-professional, you're going to need to log out. Okay, up here at the top where it says log out, you're going to have to click on that and then you're going to have to wait. So you're going to want to wait at least a couple minutes. Okay, so this is the part that I was having problems with. Um, and uh, from what I understand, what you need to do is at this point, you need to log out. You need to let the system, uh, you know, recognize that you've signed these agreements and that you are a non-professional and after a couple of minutes has gone by you're gonna to wanna to log back in 
Okay, so I'm going to go back to the to the login page. The, so this is the page that you'll see after you've logged back in. Okay, and then the next thing you're going to want to do is uh, you're going to go into Client Services. You're going to go under General. And then in this Subscriptions tab, you're going to click on the Subscriptions tab. And then uh, you're going to see, I believe you're going to see a lot more subscriptions under Available Subscriptions. You should see this Streaming News, and you should see Real-Time NASDAQ Level 2 Quotes. You're going to want to subscribe to those. Okay, those are free. If you look under Price, they should say zero zero dollars per month for both so you're going to want to click on the subscribe button and after you do that uh, under it there, there will be a your subscriptions section and you should see those two subscriptions there okay after you've done that so once that's done once, once that you have these uh, streaming news and real-time NASDAQ level 2 quotes under your current subscriptions, you're ready to download the software. Okay, so up here under trade, this trade tab, you're going to go over to trading platforms and you're going to click on thinkorswim. And then up here you're going to see a green button you're going to click on download think or swim and then once you click on that it's going to download and you're going to need to install it uh, and then uh, once you've installed it I'm going to share my think or swim uh, screen here you're going to want to make sure that at the top left it says connected in green letters and then it says real-time data Okay, this is important. If it doesn't say real-time data, then something is not right. Okay, you're going to have delayed uh, data. You want real-time data. Okay, if you guys have any issues, uh, feel free to contact me or uh, you can contact TD Ameritrade's uh, customer support line. They're very helpful and they should be able to help you resolve this issue. But if you follow the instructions, you shouldn't have any problems, okay? So, uh, again, if you guys have any issues, feel free to contact me. Um, but that, that's pretty much it, guys. So, thanks for watching. If you found this video useful, uh, please like and subscribe. Uh, if you don't already have Robinhood, feel free to use my referral link that's down the, in the uh, description. Uh, that way we both get a free stock. Uh, if anybody has any questions, uh, feel free to reach out to me. Either leave me a comment down below or if you want to email me directly. Uh, I've also left my email address down in the description. Uh, if you guys have any future topics you'd like for me to discuss or make a video on, also let me know and I'll make it happen. I will have uh, a couple videos coming up. Uh, one of them, I'll show you how to make a scanner so that you can, uh, you know, filter down uh, some stocks that you can look at and uh, do some research on and then uh, I'll make another video showing you what I look at when I'm when I'm researching uh, stocks so you know stay tuned for those videos uh, but thanks again uh, as always have fun trading stocks